Hello everyone, sorry for not uploading in like a month, but I'm uploading again and as of one of the newest updates to Blender 2.93, it's the main release version right now, there's been a new way to create outlines for objects. I did another video on this before and that one was mainly about lines around the outside and on the edges but they've come up with a new way to do this in blender it's a lot more convenient now and a lot more customizable and it uses grease pencil so as you saw at the start if i am to take this away you see that there is a cup right here and it looks absolutely perfect but it is actually an illusion which perfectly lines up with the camera to be correct so i am going to start a new project now i'm going to, i'm just going to add an object using blender kit i've done a video on this before what i'm going to do now is i'm going to add the modifier to it to show how it works so this isn't actually a modifier for the object itself it's a modifier for a grease pencil which was it's mainly used for 2d stuff in blender so all you have to do is add a grease pencil blank grease pencil it's in the scene although you can't see it because there's nothing in it and and first things first i'm going to add a new layer and i'm just going to keep it how it is this is needed for it to work so yeah now just go to the modifier properties add a modifier a line arts modifier change the source type to be object and the source object is our mug or our circle as it says the target layer is our layer and still nothing would have happened because we need to choose our target material we haven't made a material yet so go over to your material properties your grease pencil and add a new material just keep it as it is for now we can change it later if we like go back to your modifiers and choose the material to be our material and straight away you can see the outlines pop up just as they were going to in the first place that in the example so I'm quickly going to go to this view here and we can increase the angle for this. So any angle, 180 degree angle, will include all the vertices in this model. And so you want to take that down a bit till it only includes the ones at the edges, unless that's what you're going for, of course. And you can also go down to style and increase the thickness of this outline. I mean, this is still quite new. And so there's still a couple of issues going around, going on. But it gets the job done and it's fully animatable. So if I quickly animate this, be back with you in a sec. So I've now animated it. And you see when I press play on the animation, you see it turns and the grease pencil updates in pretty much real time. I mean, it's still not entirely real time, but it pretty much updates to how you need it to throughout the animation. So this is fully animatable. It's very good if you want to make like a sort of like what they did in Spider-Man Miles Morales. Anything like that's quite good if you want to do any of that. And yeah, there's also if you were to go into materials of the grease pencil, if I'm to click on my grease pencil in particular here, go to materials, you can choose the base color of this to be any color you want. So it can have any type of outline just like in my other video. So that's basically the line art modifier everything you need to know about it and yeah it's just a great way of getting new outlines around all your 3d models also only small percentage of people who watch our videos are subscribed so if not subscribed please consider subscribing i will upload more regularly and yeah just subscribe <laughs>